ਡੰਡਾਉਤ ਬੰਦਨ ਅਨਕ ਬਾਰ ਸਰਬ ਕਲਾ ਸਮਰਥ ਡੋਲਣ ਤੇ ਰੱਖ ਹੋ ਪ੍ਰਭੂ ਨਾਨਕ ਦੇ ਕਰ ਹੱਥ ਤੇਰੇ ਜੋਰ ਮੈਂ ਗੁੰਗਾ ਕਹਤਾ ਹੂੰ ਤੇਰਾ ਸਦਕਾ ਤੇਰੀ ਸ਼ਰਣ ਸਤਨਾਮ ਸ੍ਰੀ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਦੀਪਕ ਹੇਤ ਪਤੰਗ ਦਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਤਨ ਤਨ ਸਤਿਗੁਰੂ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਸ੍ਰੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਗ੍ਰੰਥ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਦੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਸਾਧ ਸੰਗਤ ਵੀ ਬਲੈਸਡ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਗਦਰ ਟੁਗੇਦਰ so we can continue learning from the vara of pai sa pai gurdas sahib ji the vara which have been blessed as the key to understanding gurbani and gursikhi in this 17th body of the second vara pai sahib ji is going to help us understand the pankti that we read every day jain prem kiyo ten hi prab payo how they're going to give different examples of how different beings love different things and it's that is the type of love we need to have not with this world but with wahiguru and that is how we will find wahiguru so let us concentrate and focus on the teachings pai sahib ji is giving us in this body satnam shri wahiguru sahib ji deepak het patang da jal meen taran da so deepak is like a burning lamp any type of light patang is like obviously a moth the moths always fly around light we see that when we turn if we turn one light on specifically in india we'll see all the moths coming to that light they love the light even though that light might burn them they will always go to that light jal meen taranda jal is water obviously mean is a fish and the fish will die outside of water that's how much love a fish has for that water because it will die outside of it mirg nad vismad hai pavar kaval vasanda so for a deer a musical sound that is the source of the delight of a deer and at the same time the black blee the love for the lotus flower and it will always fly around the lotus flower the fragrance it gets from it chand chakor parit hai dekh dhyan taranda so a partridge always focuses and concentrates on the moon the chakor is like a partridge it is a partridge and it will always focus on the moon that is and it will always dhyan tarda ya that is the love of a partridge chakvi suraj het hai sanjog bananda so the female uh, chakavi when the sun rises that is when a chakavi will meet its male partner and conceive it will not do it at another time it will only do it when the sun rises that is the love it has for the sunrise so pai sahib ji has given different examples of different beings different animals they've created and how their love is and they wait for that specific they long for that time when they have a love for that specific moment and coming towards the end of this body nar patar pyar hai nar is a woman and patar is the husband so a woman loves her husband and how does she become a mother ma pot milanda when they have a male when they meet together physically she becomes a mother of her son and she brings forth her son she basically conceives so just like a woman loves her husband just like a, a chakavi loves the sun and that sunrise time just like a partridge a chakor loves the moon and does that prem towards the moon and concentrates on the moon just like a deer loves that musical sound and is vismad has bliss from that sound just like a bumblebee loves that lotus flower just like a moth loves that burning lamp and just like a fish cannot live outside of water that is the type of love we should have with akal purakh wahiguru and that is how we will find and become wahiguru and at the end ape aap vartada gurmukh parchanda so a gurmukh is content again they gain that content that santok because they know they have that love they've developed that love and they have found wahiguru they become one with wahiguru they've realized wahiguru with inside themselves and all of creation ape ap vartada they know wahiguru is one but they are infinite also because they exist in all the creation that is the type of love we should have like these examples pai sahib ji has given with wahiguru with the shabad of gurbani we shouldn't be led astray by maya society this is the type of love we must develop for the shabad as a starting point to recite the shabad over and over before we have and before we become one with the lord and have the true love with the abanasi the nirgun form with wahiguru if i've offended anybody or made mistakes i beg for forgiveness sad sangat me bless me so i can continue sharing these teachings from pai gurdas tiyan vara so we can all understand 
ਗੁਰਬਾਣੀ ਗੁਰਸਿੱਖੀ ਬੈਠ ਦੇਹ ਹੋ ਸੱਜਣ ਅਸੀਂ ਛੜਿਆ ਜਿਹੋਵਾ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਸੀ ਮੇ ਲੇਖਾ ਕਤ ਨਾ ਛੁਟੀ ਅਖੇਨ ਕੇ ਪੂਲਨ ਹਾਰ ਬਖਸਨ ਹਾਰ ਬਖਸ ਲੈ ਨਾਨਕ ਬਾਰ ਉਤਾਰ ਆਪੇ ਆਪ ਵਰਤ ਦਾ ਗੁਰਮੁਖ ਪਰਚੰਡਾ ਗੁਰਮੁਖ ਪਰਚੰਦਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਮੇਰੀ ਖਾਲ